monkey chased the weasel, the monkey thought it was all in fun. Pop goes the weasel. Hello everyone, this is Priyanka and welcome to the 11th and the last video of the series that we are doing here, which is Childhood on Guitar. As I said, this is the last video and we are covering the song today, Pop Goes the Weasel. Okay, so let's begin with the tutorial first. Let me tell you the chords, the strumming as well as the chord progression. Beginning with, beginning with the chords, okay. The, this song actually has only three chords, easy chords, okay. First is G. First is G. Second is D, all open chords, okay? And third is C. I'll be using capo on the first fret. Now, you, uh, if you like, you can remove the capo or you can adjust it on any other position to suit your voice. So, the three chords, G, D, and C. Let me mention one thing here that I am using G add 9 chord here because this song actually has a chord progression where G and D comes back to back. They come back to back. So I am. it is much easier to use this transition from G to D. G, I am using G add 9 and then back to D. G add 9, D. G add 9, D. Okay, you can see the picture here how you can transition from G to D and it makes the transformation of the chords, the chord progression uh, very smooth, okay? And then we have C, okay? G, D and C, okay? Now the chords are done. Let's talk about the chord progression. So this is the chord progression and it is applicable on the all the verses of the song okay for all the verses you will play only this chord progression no matter the words or the the verse you are playing this is the same the chord progression will remain the same throughout the song okay so this is the chord progression and uh, now coming to the strumming pattern well strumming is fairly easy down down up down, down, up. Down, down, up. Down, down, up. Down, down, up. It's fairly easy, okay? Down, down, up. Down, down, up. All around the corpus when the monkey chased the weasel, the monkey thought it was all in fun. Pop goes the weasel. Like this, okay? Down, down, up. Down, down, up. In this song, actually, the chords are pretty easy. The strumming is also very easy. But the only thing that can challenge your performance is to the quick um, chord progression. Pro chord progression is uh, you have to shift to G, to D, and then back to G for the first three lines of each verse. And then in the end, you have to shift to C immediately to D and then back to G this song is fast paced and it it requires your full attention so the best way to not fail at covering the chord progression is to make sure to remember which chord you are going to play next if you are playing G then remember that the next chord in the line is D okay and this is applicable for all all the verses for all the first uh, three lines of all the verses and for the fourth line you immediately have to shift to C then back to G and then at last we have G okay so the best tip I can give you to be able to play this song successfully is to remember which chord you are going to play next okay so let's begin with the cover for, uh, cover then Bush, 
How, uh, how I ended this song well I ended by singing that's the way the money goes if you're playing the last verse because this song has more verses I did three to more verses and uh, when you're playing the last verse on the third line that's the way the money goes you play only down strums you can choose to sing this line for three times okay just as I did and then you can uh, end the song with pop goes the weasel like this you can end the song okay it helps you to avoid avoid the monotony in your performance okay and uh, i hope the tutorial was clear as well as the cover and you got the idea how i played this song for third line of each uh, for third whenever you are singing this verse uh, a penny for a spool of thread or half a pound of tapani rice okay Whenever you are playing these kind of verses, then on the third line, you only play down, down. Whenever you are singing, that's the way the money goes. That's the way the money goes. That's the way the money goes. Immediately shift to C. Pop goes the weasel. Then you can stop there. Pop goes the weasel. And then you can resume your playing, okay? We're picking up on the next verse. All around the mulberry bush, the monkey chased the weasel. See, this is the way you can actually continue uh, with the song. So this is the whole guitar lesson for the children's song, Pop Goes the Weasel. And uh, well, we are done with the series and yay, it's a big, yay, it's a big, uh, it's a big, uh, it's a very big occasion for me uh, I guess occasion I can say it's a big day for me because this series was a big responsibility on my shoulders and yes um, if you have been following my uh, following me on this channel then you will know that I'm actually late by one week uh, to to be able to upload this cover and uh, well what can I say I was fine my guitar was fine everything was fine but something just happened in between and I just couldn't properly practice because practice is the key to everything even if it is the simplest things of life practice is the key to everything to you know to do it properly so I couldn't uh, sit down properly and practice Let, uh, let's not talk about uh, making a cover okay so finally I did it today and I'm so happy and thank you so much for staying with me on this journey. I really appreciate okay, you being here. So as I said, we completed 11 songs. Okay, we started with happy birthday. Okay, we started with happy birthday to you. Well, the link in the description, you can check it out. Happy birthday, then we played Twinkle Twinkle, then one to Buckle My Shoe and Wheels on the Bus. Then we had Baba, Black Ship, Old MacDonald had a farm. Then if you're happy and you know it, then Jingle Bells. Jingle Bells was the 10th video, okay, posted last week. Then London Bridge is falling down, row, row, row your boat. And finally, we have Pop Goes the Weasel. Okay, so this is not the completely the order that I have posted my guitar lessons. But this is the list of the songs that we have covered here. And I feel so proud of myself. I know that maybe on uh, maybe my voice 
it is not uh, match at some point with my guitar but i am working on it i am getting feedback about this people appreciate like how much i am dedicated to my guitar despite being a self learner because lots of people they leave uh, learning guitar because it's a very complicated instrument but uh, uh, despite being a self learner i continue with it i do my best i promise you that i do my best whenever i sit down to practice okay so i'm getting feedback then that my voice needs to match with the guitar and i am taking care of it okay that's why i have added capo here so this is all uh, all the 11 songs are done and this series is done and uh, i am glad that this year i completed actually two series first was course made easy and then the childhood on guitar you can check out my channel for all those uh, videos i had so much fun learning the uh, doing this series i never thought that some of the songs actually some of the children's songs they are actually uh, they are pretty difficult uh, to play not only because that they had difficult chords or unusual chords to cover but also because they, they have such quick chord progression the, their chord progression is so quick so fast paced that it presents a unique challenge to you and uh, i think this is a good challenge uh, if you are a musician if you are a guitarist because it helps it gives you the chance to grow okay it gives you the chance to learn something new and you get better at it once you have covered it nicely so doing the series has been a lot of fun a ride uh, of uh, full of learning and and uh, you know excitement and you know sometimes frustration not not being able to getting the get the song or not to not being able to come up with the proper strumming or or yes not to mention not being able to upload it on time but i did it finally and uh, i'm so glad about it so so the series is done and i guess i've said it for i guess 3 to 4 times okay so i'm not sure which what i'm going to start next but i'm trying to dive into the tabs the leads because i am more over a chords person okay i i always play songs on chords okay but now i think it's time i should dive into something different into an entirely different aspect of music for me for guitar it is tabs so i'm trying a song since um, since some time let's see if i am able to get it right okay so that's it for today thank you so much for watching this video and uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel uh, i'm not a best guitarist definitely not and i'm not pro yes but yes i do know a couple of things about guitar about music and the best thing about uh, myself Uh, in being a guitarist is that i believe in uh, learning i believe in um, keeping the passion alive when it comes to music or writing i am also an author by the way check out my new ebook which has come uh, which has come on amazon kindle link i am i will attach in the description so the best thing about me i guess is uh, i i i keep learning how to keep the passion alive for at whatever i do so over the time i will definitely get my voice matched synced with my uh, with the chords and everything and uh, and that's it i'm not going to talk too much now <laughs> okay thank you so much do subscribe and uh, if you have any feedback to uh, to give away then make sure you be kind okay because everyone has their own struggles and you have no idea like what uh, your um just as in a spur of moment how you can spin someone's life in a different direction so if you say something even if you don't like this uh, video which is also fine i am fine with it if you don't like this video but if you are going to say it make sure you use the positive attitude to say it because that i will appreciate very much okay thank you so much and i will see you in the next